Hi guys, welcome to my channel. This is Carol and today I'm doing a video on my YSL wallet on chain bag. This bag retails for $13.50 and can be purchased um, at different stores like Nordstrom, Neiman Marcus, or even abroad, which is actually what I ended up doing this past September when I traveled to Paris to celebrate my one year wedding anniversary. And I actually got a really good deal on this bag which is why I'm doing a separate video on it later to just talk about the process that I went through to find that perfect bag and really save some bucks. So stay tuned for that video. But for the purposes of this one in particular, I just really wanted to highlight some of the features that I love about this bag and really show you guys what fits inside in case you know, you're interested in purchasing one, which I think you should because it's a really great investment and it's just a statement timeless piece that um, I'm just in love with. So getting started, the leather is just so nice. I don't know if you guys can really see it, but it's this quilted, um, really shiny, nice, it's like a pattern. I don't know if it's like a zigzag, but it's really, really nice quilted leather. And it has this gold hardware that just stands out that I love. And you can you can spot this like a mile away. It's, it's just really, really nice. It also has this gold chain um, that also has this, I guess, a shoulder pad on top. And one of the things that I really love about this bag compared to the large one, which retails for $15.50, is that you can truly wear this crossbody comfortably. The other one you can also, but it's a little bit tighter. The large bag, uh, it's definitely bigger so you can fit more, but um, the chain is all chain. There's no like this, there's no this thing here. So I think maybe that just limits um, how you can wear it crossbody, or maybe this chain is just smaller. But I, I just wasn't a big fan of that because I really do enjoy wearing this crossbody. So that's one of the reasons why I went with this bag versus the bigger version. But you can still wear this bag in a variety of different ways. So besides just, you know, the crossbody, you can also wear it in like a shoulder bag. So what you would do is just take one end, go inside, right? Take the other end, go once inside. And then you close it. Yep. And there you go. It's like a smaller, smaller chain. Or if you want it even smaller than this, um, what you would do is just taking off all these chains, you would go outside in, right? Outside, in, like this. Close it. And there you go. It's an even smaller kind of bag. But we're not done yet. There's actually one more way to use it, which is just completely removing the chains. So they're completely detachable. I'm not gonna I'm I'm not gonna take it out, but you can just unhook the um the chain and then you just have a clutch. So definitely worth the investment, not just for the looks and the quality, but also just for the different ways in which you can use this bag. So whether it's just really like a formal mm -hmm. event, actually this bag can be worn to a formal event, the way it is as a crossbody. But if you really wanted like to go to an evening, like a wedding or something, and you want a clutch, that's your bag, or if you really want it to just go out into the city and have some fun, this is your bag. So, I mean, definitely an investment and I just love it. Jumping into what it looks like inside, we have just the one big pocket in the middle for your essentials. Um, there's this one large pocket in the back, it's a little bit tighter. Then we have six card slots. I'm not sure if you guys can see that, but it's like right here. And then there is a zippered section. It's about the same size really as the one in the back, but it's just zippered. So definitely very roomy. You can fit a lot of stuff, which is what I'm gonna show you guys right now. 
putting some things in there. Um, so there are a few a few items that I always take to me regardless of you know what kind of bag I really wear and um, I just I just have to take these items with me. So I was so glad to find out that this bag, although it's very small, um, it does fit what I need. So jumping into it, some cash. I like to put that in the zippered section just because I don't like touching it all the time. So I put that in here. Then we have some cards, F3 here for the purposes of this video. But um, so we have two credit cards and my driver's license, my ID. Plop them right in here. Um, then I have my, this is an oil blotting um, tissue thing that I bought on Amazon just because I get really oily throughout the day on my T-zone. So I have to always take this with me wherever I go. So that just fits right here. Um, you know, sometimes you just need to freshen up. So I have this um, deodorant wipe and then this summer's eve wipe also so you just never know how long i'm gonna stay out for so i just like to just take them with me in case i do need to freshen up a little bit advil um for you know whenever you get a headache or whenever someone you're with gets a headache i like to be that person that's just like oh here i have some just take it and these little packets they um just save a lot of space so i'm gonna put that in there it's a lot of space we have Lipstick, just, you know, gotta be ready to touch up. Let's have some of that in here. Mints, for just after eating something. And then hand cream, especially in the winter, my hands get super dry. So I like to have some of that in here. And as you can see, it's getting pretty full, but everything has its space. So it's, it fits comfortably in here. Um, phone, this is an iPhone XS. So I usually put that in the back, that back pocket. You can just plop that in here. And that's pretty much all there is space for. Looks a little cramped, but it fits nicely. This my hand cream, it's a little bit up there, so. But everything fits. A little tight but it does and then last but not least my keys so i'll just put that right on top so and then it closes nicely so it's still not as not stuff that you can't close it it's definitely a little heavy but it's not really bulging off the sides so i know that it's a comfortable fit and it's really everything I need, so I'm not um, really missing anything. Although uh, actually my phone will usually stay in my pocket, so I don't, I won't really keep it here anyway. So, but um, yeah, it just fits perfectly. And um, I just love this bag. So if you're really considering it, I vote yes. But if you have any other questions or concerns or just comments in general, feel free to leave them below. And thank you for watching. Bye guys.